Hey guys, this is Dshack Tech, and today I'll be doing another What's on My iPod video, so let's get started. So first up today, we have Opera Mini, which is a free application in the App Store. Basically allows you to have an elegant home screen for web browsing. It gives you nine buttons or links to web pages, your favorite web pages on this home page right here. So there it is, nine web pages. All you gotta do is click on one, let's go to apple.com say, and it's gonna load up. And so once it loads up, this is where it starts excelling more than Safari, I think. You hit this, you hit this button down here, and you can you can load up another web page. Let's go to Mac Daily News, let's say. And once that loads up, you get to multitask or multitask for web browsing, I guess you could call it. And you get to switch between these web pages very easily. So you tap and you go back at it back on the first page. There's no reloading like you've seen Safari when you go between pages like that. And you can have multiple ones. Um, before this video, I think I did up to 25 pages. Um, Seem sort of. Um, not uh, very unrealistic, but potentially you could have a whole bunch of pages right now You could have three switch in between them and it's very simple just to go back Home page um, you can do it the old-fashioned way by going into the URL box and typing in whatever you want to go to Let's say Google and that's you can do that that way too. Um, you down here. You have your um, your settings basically you have your bookmarks history start page saved pages settings help share and finding page um, other than that, it's very simple. You just hold on one. You can clear it or edit it. Let's clear that one. And so when you want to add pages, you just hit like that one. You just tap on it. And same exact thing, you type in the URL box and you saved your favorite page to your home page. One downside to this application is that you don't have more than nine um, links or buttons in your home page. That sort of sucks. I, I have more than nine favorite pages, but it's okay. I get used to it. Um, so it's very simple. You just go back to your web page and just like that. So this is Opera Mini, which is a free application in the App Store. So next up, we have an application that looks on the lazy side of your organizational needs, and it's called Free Time. This is again a, a free application in the App Store. Um, basically, it tells you um, how much free time you have in your day or in your schedule. It basically syncs with your calendar on your iPod or your Mac, and it tells you how many free free hours you have in the day. So today I have a free day. I have nothing planned for today. But on Wednesday, I have 13 hours free because in my calendar, I have put, I have put I have soccer practice from 5 to 7. And that syncs with your calendar, and it puts it right there, and it tells you, and it works around that, and tells you how much free time you have in the day for you to be lazy and do nothing. Um, you set up your days or your schedule very, very simply. In your settings part, you go, you can start your day. So I usually wake up at 6.30 a.m. I can change that to whenever, 9.30. I can... Go to work 7 35 o'clock i work am not free <laughs> between 7 35 o'clock you can go to bed at 10 o'clock you have your meals um meals breakfast lunch and dinner and then you can have your sharing options with the time blocks and other things like that since this since the application i'm showing you right now is a free one there is an upgrade a premium a premium one for 99 cents it basically allows you to have unlimited emails text unlimited bump bumping and no ads ever um, but since this application is free, it gives you all the bare essentials that the premium gives just with a little extra boost for the 99 cents. So I find this application free time free, very easy and sort of fun to use. And third, it just changed. Now I have 10 and a half hours free on, on Wednesday, July the 6th. Um, so that's pretty much it for free time. It's a free application in the App Store. I think it's pretty fun to use. And so lastly today, we have Speed Test which is an application that allows you to test your network speeds. Um, it, it basically does three different tests, a ping, a download, and an upload test. And it basically tells you how fast your network is. So let's begin test. And you'll see a, a speedometer come up. There it is. And it will do show you how many bits per second or whatever it is for each thing. So at 138, um, download is going right now. And so basically it's very... Um, it's a really cool application to use when you're bored to check your network speeds. And so when it's done um, testing, I'll show you guys what the tabs do down here. And so it is done right now. So upload is 5.46 megabytes per second. Download is 5.16 megabytes per second. So you have your settings down here and then your results is a pretty cool thing. So you get to see all the results you've done over time. So right now I did one like two nights ago and you can see the changes within each one. I don't know why they're different but I guess you could tell that from these results here. Um, you Then you have about settings and speed test. 
And so that's pretty much it. You can restart tests. You can do it however, however, however many times you want. Um, it's pretty cool. A little fun app to do when you're bored, and it's a quite a cool util utilities application that you guys have probably seen a lot of YouTube channels like Phone Dog or other major channels like Techno Buffalo, where they do have new phones and they test out the network speeds on on the device. So that's um, Speed Test. It's a free application in the App Store as well. That is it for this video. Hope you guys like it. Leave your thoughts in the comment sections down below. Check my channel, DShack Tech, and subscribe for more app reviews, app news, rumors, Joe Breaks, as well as Mac OS 10 tutorials, and more What's on my iPod videos. Follow me on Twitter for my thoughts on the daily tech news. And as always, thanks for watching.